friends, welcome back to my channel and welcome if you're new here. My name is Jen, I'm a certified weight loss and nutrition coach and I'm on the WW or the Weight Watchers Blue Plan. Happy Saturday! It's Saturday, so it's another grocery haul day. We had quite a good stock up haul this week. We were out of a lot of our snacky essential items, so I have a good size haul for you with some new food finds as well. So if you're excited, give this video a thumbs up. And don't forget, if you are new or you haven't yet subscribed, we'd love to have you here. Hit the subscribe button and ring the bell right next to it so you never miss a single video. Down in that description box, you're going to find nutrition coaching. I do offer personalized to you macros and and calories highly recommend whether you're on WW or not you need to know kind of where you should land every day to be successful if you want to chat with me directly I offer one-on-one -on -one coaching as well you'll find all of that down in that description box along with links discount codes to all of my favorite things and my Facebook group another community that would love to have you so head on over and join us there so let's jump into this WW grocery haul Here is this week's grocery haul. I went to Walmart and Trader Joe's. We actually need quite a few stock up type of things this week. What is not shown is the normal Diet Coke for Troy and case of Coors Light. So let's jump into the grocery haul. At Trader Joe's, I picked up these absolutely gorgeous jumbo mums. This sunny yellow color makes me so happy. I like to have flowers on my dining room table all week. So these are only $3.99, you can't beat it. I also grabbed a case of the AHA sparkling water Water, only because this flavor peach and honey sounds so delicious and you know I'm a huge fan of sparkling water I think I've tried one flavor of the aha and liked it so I'm excited for this Troy picked up crunch and munch at Rite Aid when he picked up a couple prescriptions and we love it this is the buttery toffee popcorn with peanuts it's a better version of Cracker Jacks it is so delicious it's only 150 calories per serving and we like just to have this on hand is a sweet treat I forgot to pick up water when I was at Costco, so I ended up getting the 32 pack of Dasani. A graham cracker crust, this is for meal prep. I am so excited for this week's meal prep. Stay tuned after the grocery haul for my meal plan and what you'll see on Monday in my meal prep video. Wine, because it's been a week, and I love Moscato, and I like these little bottles because it's easy for portion control, and I'm not a huge drinker. I don't drink wine every day, so once I open a bottle, it goes bad. So these work out really well for me, so this is a four pack of the Sutter Home Moscato. Moscato. One third less fat cream cheese. This is for a meal prep. We were completely out of cheese slices and I don't know, baby Swiss just sounded really good. So I picked that up. My favorite eggs ever, the Organic Happy Egg Company. I love these eggs. This is $7 for an 18 pack at Walmart, which is really affordable for this brand. So every time I shop at Walmart, I like to pick up my eggs. The Armor Hickory Smoked Summer Sausage. This is for Troy. You guys already know for his meat, cheese, and crackers. And at Trader Joe's, the cheese party tray for him. This has pepper jack, Colby Jack, Swiss, and cheddar. I love the pepper jack. I'm usually the one that eats that. And then he likes all of the other flavors for his meat, cheese, and crackers. Roasted and salted cashews. This is for a dinner recipe or a lunch recipe. And then of course, I like to have cashews on hand as snacks. And Troy's actually going back to work on the 30th. So he loves cashews. So I usually will divide these up into little individual bags and throw them in his lunch. Lasagna noodles for a dinner recipe. It is a crock pot recipe. So I didn't buy the oven ready ones. I need them to stay firmer longer in the crock pot. So I just picked up the Barilla lasagna. Reduced sugar craisins. This is for a recipe. I also needed grapes and apparently there's a grape shortage in my area. Neither Walmart or Trader Joe's had grapes. So we're gonna make some substitutions, but I did need the reduced sugar craisins for that same recipe. Rice Aroni Spanish rice. This is for a dinner recipe. It actually called for Uncle Ben's, which I couldn't find. So I thought that the Rice Aroni Spanish would work in place of the Uncle Ben's. My favorite light shredded cheese from Trader Joe's. This truly is the best light shredded cheese and it's such a big bag for only $3.99. Another pack of the La Banderita carb counter tortillas. These are delicious. Dare I say I like these better than the Olay wraps. They remind me of a legit high point high calorie flour tortilla. They're so good and I need this for my lunch meal prep. Reese I picked up a pack of the chicken apple sausage from Walmart just to have in the freezer. Sometimes I just want a quick 
easy lunch and this just makes it really easy and this chicken apple sausage is delicious this entire huge link is only two smart points mister i don't like casseroles requested the chicken and wild rice casserole with the french onions on top i do have that on my recipe website that is linked down below for you highly recommend making that recipe it's so good so we're gonna have that again this week and for that recipe i needed some diced pimentos diced green chilies for my lunch meal prep french style green beans for that chicken and wild rice casserole and then two cans of no salt added cut green beans for my dogs i have gotten a few questions on this we give them green beans after we eat dinner in place of table scraps they love it and green beans are really good for dogs just try to pick up the no salt added or rinse them really well if they do contain salt my favorite marinara sauce is this organic tomato basil from trader joe's i need this for a dinner recipe troy requested soup since it's a little chilly here at least today or a little bit of this week he was really feeling some soup so i picked up the creamy tomato with a basil and new england clam chowder two cans of organic diced tomatoes with green chilies basically a rotel dupe in organic form i picked up two cans for my lunch prep a big pack of paper plates because hashtag making life easy. The three pack of the market side organic grass fed grass finished 93% ground beef. This is our favorite hamburger. It's so delicious and you get three pounds for under $18 at Walmart, which is such a fantastic price for grass fed grass finished. Small curd cottage cheese for Palmer. We are giving him cottage cheese mixed in with his food in the morning and at night just to help with calcium. It helps his ears stand up and really just helps his bones develop nice and strong. Daisy light sour cream for a dinner recipe. A small thing of whole milk. I needed some whole milk for a recipe and until Troy goes back to work, we're buying milk. My favorite quick, easy lunch or dinner are these turkey corn dogs from Trader Joe's. These are so good. Pop them in your oven, your air fryer. You can even microwave them. They're so good and they make such a quick, easy meal. New product at Trader Joe's are these strawberry and vanilla flavored yogurt pretzels. Aren't these just so pretty? I picked these up for Troy. That way he can have these in his lunch. You you guys know he loves his yogurt covered pretzels and I thought that this would be just a fun kind of springy summery flavor. I also picked him up another bag of his organic dippers. He likes these for his French onion dip and if you haven't tried the Trader Joe's corn dippers they are so good. They blow Fritos out of the water. They are so, so delicious. A big box of kombucha. I was so excited to see this flavor variety. I don't know if it's limited edition for summer, but there are six bottles total, two of the watermelon wonder, two of the golden pineapple, and two of the guava goddess. All three of these flavors are so delicious. This whole box, six bottles was $16, which is really a good deal because generally they're over $3 a bottle. So I'm hoping this variety pack is permanent, but until it is gone, if it goes away, I will be purchasing this because I love all three of these flavors. Some more Ritz crackers for Troy's cheese meat and crackers. Troy wanted peanut butter cookies, so I picked up these peanut butter chip cookie dough. Just pop them in your oven and bake them up. So I'll go ahead and make those today. They're only 90 calories per cookie, which is not bad at all. He also requested a few lean cuisines, so I picked up his favorites, the five cheese rigatoni, lasagna with meat sauce, and Alfredo pasta with chicken and broccoli. And since I was at Walmart for myself, I grabbed another box of these steamed dumplings. I love these. These are so delicious. I eat the whole box. It's a great lunch. It's 250 calories and the points here on the screen. I love them. Make sure you get the chicken and vegetable. You can get the pork. They're just higher in calories and points. And then everything else is produce. I didn't need a whole lot this week. I just received my imperfect foods order, but I did grab a bag of organic yellow onions. I'm completely out of lemons and limes for my water. And then a couple bags of frozen vegetables, this organic California blend, and broccoli. So that is everything for this week's grocery haul. It was a good big stock up haul. Let's jump into what I am making for dinners as well as what you'll be seeing on Monday for meal prep. Here's this week's menu plan. Today is Saturday. We are going out for dinner. Tomorrow, Sunday, I'm making a one pot lasagna soup. Stay tuned for this recipe and Wednesday's what I eat in a day. Monday, I'm doing a cashew chicken rotini salad. So this is a cold summer salad. I'm excited for this. We'll pair it with some protein. Tuesday is a leftovers night. Wednesday, I'm doing chicken and wild rice casserole. That's the one that my husband requested. It's truly delicious. And again, it is on my website. Thursday is a one pot Mexican chicken and rice. Make my life easy. And then Friday, we always have a leftover night to try to eat up everything from earlier in the week. Here's what you'll be seeing on Monday for meal prep. Super duper excited for these. 
Breakfast is going to be baked oatmeal. Lunch is smothered green chili chicken burritos. I can't wait for this. This is something my husband wouldn't really like. It's going to air on the spicy side and he does not do spice at all. So I'm gonna make it for a lunch prep and then I'm making no bake cheesecake. Super excited for this. This is a skinny taste recipe. So stay tuned on Monday for meal prep for all three of these amazing recipes. Thank you for joining me on another weekly WW Grocery Haul. I hope you enjoyed seeing all the good stuff that I picked up for the week, gave you a little bit of food inspiration. I'm excited for this week's dinners and stay tuned on Monday for a really delicious meal prep. So if you enjoyed today's video, don't forget to give it a huge thumbs up. And if you're new or you haven't subscribed, we'd love to have you here. Hit the subscribe button, ring the bell right next to it so you don't miss any future uploads. I do grocery hauls every Saturday so you don't wanna miss out. Check out that description box for nutrition coaching, links and discounts to my favorite things, and of course my Facebook group. Head on over, join us there as well. Thank you so much for watching. Happy Saturday, my friends, and I'll see you all in tomorrow's video. Bye.